what's up everybody, it's Pablo1713, hi and welcome in Anno 1800, quick tip and trick number 15, transferring workforce. So you might find yourself that you got those ugly buildings that produce vulgarity and pollution and maybe you want to move them and you can do this because there are two things that can help you in moving those production buildings. So having less attractive island means that you will have less money from tourists and they can give you some nice values like here almost 2k income from those tourists. If you go to the engineers tab you get commuter peer and thanks to that you will transfer workforce as you see there's two differences. If you're not sharing workforce the tab will be black and if you're sharing workforce it will be kind of bluish one. And there's a small icon, if you so click it, it will get see. you to this commuter pier. Oh, and you got the overall information about how much workers you have in overall and on this island. So if you go to the different island, as you see, I will just click it and we have this commuter pier centered and with this information about overall and island population. If you're gonna go to the influence tab, we got expansion category, which will give you additional island workforce. So you can get 50, 100 or even 200 extra workforce. You can get additional points in this expansion tab by building commuter peers, it will give you additional 15 points in influence and you can also buy some shares. Buying one share will give you additional 10 points in this expansion tab, it will also give you some additional income. So if you want to move your production buildings or maybe make some island that will produce only some specific items, you got this island and as you see you got 100 workforce in each tab. So I can just transfer grapes or I can make whole production chain. If I will live like this I'll just lose 30 farmers from the 100 base that I had. And if you will decide to make whole production chain on one island, it may happen that you will have not enough workforce because the maximum that you can have from expansion tab is 200 workers and whole production chain for champagne requires 250 artistas. So that's why I have minus 150 artistas. So to solve this problem you can use commuter peer and this commuter peer costs 15 influence points. So those influence points will be deducted from me as soon as I'll just construct this. And as you see I'm still on minus 17 artistas. But all I have to do is to go to other island that is connected with commuter pier and just upgrade there. And as you see I got plus 3 and this workforce will be shared through all the islands that has this commuter pier and thanks to that I will have 100 productivity in each production building. And thanks to that I will not produce any pollution. So if you want to reduce pollution and vulgarity on your main island, you can move all those production chains outside this main base, or maybe you just want to produce some goods on some islands without building any residence buildings. You can do this using influence in expansion tab by buying shares and conquering islands and also using community peers for your advantage. So community peers and island expansion, we need you, we'll bring your power where it's needed. So, community peer. Alright, so instead of have a nice day, boys and girls, have a wonderful day. And if you're watching this at night, then good night. See you next time. An especially exclusive assignment. Reality of it hits you. Game save.